Hey guys, welcome back to some more Ashes Cricket and part 6 of the Ashes 2017-2018 series with England. And today we have the second test match, which will be the day nighter, um, which will be very, very interesting to play in this game, I think. If you guys are enjoying the series so far, make sure you hit that like button. I really, really do appreciate it. This series has gone amazingly and I can't thank you guys enough. Let's get into it, and hopefully we'll do a little bit better this match. We're going to move up uh, to hard again. For that, we will select the lineup um, differently as well. Uh, we had Stoneman and Cook opening. We're actually going to go for the 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 one that um, was picked in real life. So we're going to play uh, Vince at three. We're going to go with Root at four, uh, Milan at five. Uh, I don't know why Hales is at six. Who was at six? It was more Ali, wasn't it? So it was Ali, um, and then whoa. So it was was it Ali before Besto? Maybe it was, and then Walks. And then Broad, and then uh, Jake Ball, and then Jimmy Anderson. So that's the squad that we're going to go for. Hopefully, it'll be uh, fun uh, with that lot. So we'll we'll uh, confirm that. Um, can we go over to the settings? There we go. Uh, shall we try and adjust their lineup to the the actual team? I think Bancroft. Um, open the baton. He's not in there, is he? Unless he's further down. Is he? Nah. Pff, haven't got a, a, a hope anyway, so we'll do that. Um, we're at Adelaide, and England tend to do very well there, so uh, we'll see how it goes. Uh, we'll leave everything on uh, random, and we'll get into it. So hopefully this will be good, and hopefully we can get back into this match. Obviously the first test match was our first match on the game and uh, we couldn't have been expected to play that well. Uh, we're going to go for the same sort of uh, plan. We're going to simulate the bowling overs if you like and we're going to go um, and, and bat 10 overs of uh, the, the each innings um, that I'm batting in each episode. So hopefully this one will go on for a little bit longer than five episodes and hopefully we'll be able to get some big scores for players and uh, that would be really really good. The loading screens on this are a little bit annoying so I apologise for that. Uh, but we are ready to get into it so I'll hand over to Matty Slater and whoever's sitting next to him to take us through the introduction of the second test match. Good afternoon everyone and welcome to the Adelaide Oval for this second Ashes Test match. Australia are coming into this match with one win to none. This match could be the turning point. A second win could make it very tough for England. I'm Michael Slater and it's my pleasure to introduce you to my co-commentator, it's Mel Jones. Afternoon Slats. Looking forward to a good contest here. It's overcast but hopefully the rain will stay away. Hard to say what the captains will do here. That looks like it's going to rain a lot in this match, so we may have some rain delays. Over now to the captains for the toss. I'm going to call Tails, because Tails never fails. Steve Smith throws it up in the air. And we have won the bar, um, the, the toss, and we are going to have a bat. To win that toss. Both would have wanted to bat first here. So, can we go and score some big runs in this match? That is the question. We've got Alistair Cook and Mark Stoneman opening the baton. And hopefully we'll be able to, to make something of this. So there you go. Alistair Cook, 100, uh, 31 hundreds and a high score of 294. Averaging 46 from 148 test matches. What can we do in this match? Let's find out. Here we go. The second Ashes test match is about to get underway. Um, somebody down in the comments said, uh, play a little bit more realistically. Uh, you know, defend a little bit more. Um, but you know, I, I'm gonna go for me shots. It's how I like to play. Yes. That was a very, very risky run to get us oh, off the mark, but it was a nice, a nice little shot. Um, nonetheless, and hopefully we can, we can improve in this match. Get a nice opening partnership. That is the plan. Doesn't play that one well. 
good club. Trying to hook them early on maybe isn't the best idea. <laughs> but we'll we'll try our best. Yeah, nice little defensive shot there. We'll play ten overs of this first innings and uh, we'll see where we go from there. We'll see how long the video has been. We'll see how many we've scored, but I, I am planning to take this a little bit more slowly. Uh, but take me shots when I can. Oof. And that's a single. So a couple of risky runs to to get us off the mark. Hopefully we'll be able to uh, do a little bit better than that in the in the rest of the match. That was a decent shot from Alistair Cook, but there we go. Uh, first over complete, two off it. I think we can uh, be quite happy with that. Waiting. We've got the pink ball in this match, remember, because it is a day-night uh, test match. So we're starting in the middle of the afternoon, so it should be the best conditions for batting right about now. Um, but we're just going to keep going. Try our best to, to get some good runs on the scoreboard. 400 would be absolutely amazing. I know that's yeah. maybe a little bit ambitious. After my first test performance, that's a good little shot from Mark Stoneman and gets off uh, the mark in terms of boundaries. And a nice little leg glance for four there. Yeah. If we can come out of today's episode without losing a wicket. That would be absolutely incredible. We are trying <laughs> the the cover drive a bit more than we probably should be, if we want that to be the case. Oh, there's a nice little gap just past the bowler. And there it is. We found it. And we can possibly come back for three here. Uh, we're not going to. I think we would have made that. That's a bit of an expensive over. Yeah. Anyway, Mark Stoneman looking quite nice. Hopefully we can get the, the same sort of um, performance from Alastair Cook. Yes. That's a lovely little shot. Through the covers. It's going to run away for four. Through the covers for four. Great shot. Nice shot. Oh, yes, yes. And another one. Just going to be the single this time. They take a single. Just a lack of concentration there. Solid. Close. Just a signal there. They'll take a single. Gonna be another fall. It is. <clears throat> Good stuff. Good start for us here. So, what did you guys think of the the first test match? Um, I thought I thought it was quite good. Australia, obviously. Ooh. Swings and misses. It was a short ball. I didn't actually see where where the the marker was, so I assumed it was a Yorker. But um, no, I thought it was a good standard first test match. Oh, the inside edge. Um, oh, not able yeah, to I think I think England were, were typical England, and uh, yeah, I think Adelaide is going to be our best chance to win a uh, win a Test match, and uh, hopefully we can encourage them in real life by winning this Test match here. That would be absolutely amazing. But uh, no, we'll just have to see how it goes. Let me know. 
down in the comments what you what you thought about it. Plays and misses. Led buys. Been a good over this from Josh Hazelwood. Hazel gets the better of the batsman. End of the over, and again, it's a good one for the bowling side. Oh, that hit the batsman at pace. It looked painful. Missed times that one. Delivery, but well kept out. The bowler beats the bat. Hmm. I think we've got the the better of us at the moment. We need to just sort of assert, reassert our our authority here. Just play. A few sensible shots, if you like, and uh, and really get back into this. Swing again, in. just struggling with uh, the back foot shots. No That's that one. what I'm uh, kind of struggling with at the moment. There's one. Oh, there's one right there. It was a little bit of an edge, but it was all right. Hmm. So that was a, a maiden over, I think. Or did we get one? The bowler beating them all ends up there. Hmm. Starting to struggle a little bit here after a really good start. Starting to just. Panic. Yes. That's a, a good shot. Oh, get back! Oh my word, that was close. The batsman in a way, lucky not to connect there. He misread that and could easily have found the edge. He lets that go through to the keeper. This isn't going well, uh. but we're surviving, and that's that's progress. Sneaker Stone getting some bat on ball again. That's a a nice little shot to get a little bit of confidence back. One run there. Get him off strike as well, because I think Hazelwood has has had the pleasure of of both openers so far. To be honest with you. It was an interesting shot that, kind of a, a slower delivery wasn't it, so 6 overs gone, 20 without loss, not too bad a start, a bit more realistic for you, scoring 3 and over at the moment, oh, I really want to hit one of them, uh, good work. Yeah, we want to kind of hit it through the... Ooh, what, what was that? <laughs> In that direction is what I was trying to say. Well, what a delivery! Let's that go through to the keeper. Yes! It's a nice shot. Oh! It's close. Oh, he's given it. Is a key part of the <sighs> just, I don't know, they just don't seem to uh, have any urgency when running. I don't think that was... I mean, the umpire wasn't even looking. 
Yeah, it was out though. Anyway, now here comes James Vince. Let's see what he's all about in this game. Bialis could gone. It's 21 for 1. Mitchell Stark. What's he gonna do? Oh, it was a wide the first delivery, that's interesting. That's a nice little shot. That's a lovely little shot. Gonna get two out of that. Good stuff. And two runs added. Good stuff. Can Stoneman and Vince do what they did in the first test match in real life and, and go and get some big scores here? I mean, they didn't get huge scores in the first test match, but 83 and 52 or whatever it was, a uh, decent start. Three of us to go in this episode. Can we go uh, and keep these? Uh, I'm not going to run that. <laughs> After that, run out before... Oh, for goodness sake, why don't they just run? Stoneman gone. A very early departure. Yeah, we're just going to have to stop running now, aren't we? James Vince comes to the crease now, what can he do? Yeah, gets off the mark straight away. Yeah, and there just seems to be no urgency, and I am pressing R2 as well, uh, speed them up a bit. Just don't seem to care. That's four. That is four. I think. I don't know. Oh no, there's somebody out there. Oh wow. Doesn't play that one well. Was a buy or two buys. Don't know if that counts as a like a, an extra delivery or not. Oh, that's got to hurt. Misjudge that one. Swing and a miss. The batsman misjudging that one. Wait there. Oh, wait. Over's gone. It is uh, 27 for 2. Which is not what we want. <clears throat> Two run outs so far. Rather annoying. Not the ideal way of handling that ball. Doesn't play that one well. I think I'm just going to start leaving the short ones, to be honest with you. Didn't like the look of that one. No shot offered. Dives and grabs that one. Was expecting that one, Mitchell. So we've got just over and over to go. Can we keep these two in? Yep, yep. Great shot. That's a nice shot. Great timing. Can we come back for three? I think we can. If we've got a bit of urgency, and we do, just about. So now Joe Root gets a go. Oh, nice shot. That's just going to be the single. They take the single. So, 31 for two. We've got 31, uh, we've got one over left, uh, uh, apologies. Yep. That's a lovely shot, we finally hit a short one. Don't think it's quite going to make it to the boundary, that was close, but we can come back for three here, maybe. Mm, we'll, we'll call that one off. Gets two. Yeah, nice little glance down a uh, fine leg. And another good shot there. 
going to come back for two. Oh, well fielded. That was headed to the boundary. He'll get two for that. Good shot. Risking those, do we? <laughs> After the the two runouts that we've had so far. Waiting. At least we're getting back on ball though, which is good. The keeper excited for a second there, nearly took the edge. Final ball of the day. Oh, and we hit it through the covers, and it's just going to be a single. But a, a decent start for us. We obviously lost the two wickets, but hopefully we've learnt a lesson. Uh, we're not going to um, try and uh, run those tight singles anymore, and we'll try and build a solid total. So if you've enjoyed that, make sure you leave a like down below. If we could hit 50 likes on this video, that would mean the world to us. So please, please, please hit that like button. Subscribe if you'd, if you'd like to see more, and I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching, and goodbye.